we have just arrived at the next Wildlife Trust Reserve and this is the Devizes and Roundway Orchard and Old Cricket Field. And the main point of us coming here is these incredible old apple trees. I mean, it just looks amazing. It's, uh, the sun, it's been really cloudy this morning, so we haven't come down particularly early because it would have been a bit of a waste of time. The sun's starting to come through the, the trees there. But um, yeah, first impressions are beautiful, beautiful old apple trees. We've come, um, we've just come from, um, which one was it? It was the Devizes Orchard um, Nature Reserve. And we've come to the place between West Lavington and Market Lavington. We've come here because this is the place where really, I first sort of really loved, fell in love with nature. I was, well, I used to go to primary school in West Lavington and then my home was in Market Lavington. I used to walk along here every single day. Um, and one day when I was walking home, I didn't come up here, I would have been about 10 years old. I barely came up to the top of this railing. Um, and I watched a water vole for about 20 minutes. Felt like about an hour, but I'm sure it wasn't. So I'd watch this water vole swimming to the bank, coming out onto, it was, there was so much water weed and stuff like that, that, it would sit on top of it, snap off a bit and then munch away. And I remember seeing this sort of bit of weed disappearing into its mouth, like it was sucking it inside, it was amazing. Um, and that I think was the moment. And that's why Wiltshire, Wildlife Trust or Wiltshire itself is so special to me really um, because this is the place where I really fell in love with nature um, and this river here in beforehand was absolutely full of weed of uh, plant life and vegetation as you rammed full of it as you can see now there is, there is some weed there is some plant life um, but just nowhere near as much which I suppose is indicative of the state of our rivers right now so it's quite sad to see, but hopefully things will improve and the work that the Wildlife Trust are doing will definitely help that.